Good morning and happy Thursday to you. Titans were starting off with locally dense fog out there. You can see our live sky cam shot over Claremont is seeing uh, that very reduced visibility. Visibilities have been reduced to under a quarter of a mile at times. That's why we're still under a dense fog advisory for the I-75 corridor. If you're in Sumter Lake, even Polk counties, make sure you're using that extra caution when you're on the roadways because our local interstates are going to be seeing that rapidly reduced visibility at times. Besides that, not only do we have the fog, we're dealing with the low clouds this morning. Satellite imagery showing that stalled frontal boundary over the peninsula, but we expect that to lift on back to the north as a warm front, and that's going to set the stage for a building high pressure system and allow us to really heat up. Look at the forecasted temperatures mid 80s as we head into your Friday and Saturday approaching the records in the upper 80s to near 90. So it's going to be very hot for this time of year, unseasonably warm. And today we expect that trend to start. So we look for afternoon high temperatures in the low 80s, partly sunny and very warm. We've had four days in December already where we've seen those 80 degree temperatures are higher. The record is 23. I don't think we're going to get anywhere near that, thankfully, but it is going to be an unseasonably warm stretch through the week. Futurecast, we're going to keep the clouds with us in the morning hours. We're going to break out a few peaks of sunshine for the afternoon and a few isolated coastal showers can't be ruled out, but it's going to be a mostly cloudy day to start. High temperatures in the upper 70s, 78 in DeBerry, 74 in New Smyrna Beach. It's going to be low 70s for the coast line today. Tonight dropping back down to 60 areas of fog once again locally dense reducing visibility at times so keep that in mind. Tomorrow we're going to start off with the fog low 80s and for the rest of the week. Wow look at these temperatures mid 80s for your Friday and Saturday. Finally we start to clear out on Monday as a cold front approaches and high temperatures back down near seasonable averages in the mid 70s.